Right now, our country and our world are enduring a terrible global pandemic. During this crisis, we have had to act fast as a country to provide for our residents. And yet, despite our best efforts, still over 80,000 people have died. And more than 1.4 million people have gotten sick from COVID-19 in the U.S. alone. Even with those daunting statistics, over 131,000 TPS recipients have continued to work on the front lines of this epidemic as your essential workers. TPS recipients have sacrificed to protect you and the life you lead. But so far, our nation's response and support has left them out. All across the country, from California to Texas to Boston and New York, TPS recipients have been your healthcare workers, your food providers, your delivery people, and your transportation professionals. Over 11,000 TPS recipients have worked caring for the sick and in supporting our medical response to the pandemic as nurses, aides, orderlies, and technologists. TPS recipients have worked courageously to keep our food chains operational. Over 76,000 residents have sacrificed daily to provide you your needs, from food preparation to farming and shipping. And many other TPS recipients have worked keeping our shared spaces sanitary and disinfected. TPS holders have risked their safety and their family's safety for the good of the country and of their communities. Now, they ask for you to protect them in return. TPS work authorizations and protections are set to expire very soon. Because of the pandemic, the chance for legislative action on TPS and other visa statuses has been seriously slowed. We can't abandon those who are fighting so hard for us during this pandemic. This is why we must act now. During the upcoming stimulus vote in Congress, we must urge our senators and representatives to include automatic extensions of work authorization for TPS recipients. Really? TPS recipients deserve permanent residency, but the least we could do is to offer them an automatic extension of work authorizations. This would allow them to continue contributing to our communities throughout the pandemic and provide our legislators the time to pass permanent solutions once the crisis has passed. Without those extensions, TPS recipients who are sacrificing for us daily could face possible deportation and their families' separations. That will be the thanks we give these tax-paying model community members. They will lose everything they have built here over the last 25 years. My name is Juana Pineda. I am a TPS recipient and I am a sensor worker at Janitronic Company. I am risking my life every day to protect and provide for this country and for you. And now you must protect my family by demanding an automatic extension of work authorization for TPS recipient. Please write to your representatives insisting they automatically extend TPS. As under the HEROES Act, TPS recipients have been working to protect you. Now you must help protect them and their families. Take 10 minutes today. Contact your representatives by phone or by email and insist they automatically extend work authorizations. We are standing with you. Will you stand with us? We are standing with you. Will you stand with us? We are standing with you. Will you stand with us?